We are the Green Couple, and we are in Japan. Yes, uh, today uh, it's a little cold, a little wet. Um, a little bit. My voice is shot. I've been kind of under the weather the past few days, but I'm getting better eventually. We're up real early because we are heading to Kyoto. Yep. That's right. We're going to be going on a Shinkansen bullet train for the very first time. Uh, we're going to vlog a little bit. It's going to be nice and simple. No fancy equipment or anything like that. No. Just us and whatever we see on the way. Hopefully, we don't get rained on because yeah. I don't think this is waterproof. But no. <laughs> Come join us. Let's go. Well, we are at Tokyo Station. We got our tickets for the Shinkansen. We do have a JR pass, and that means you get to ride on any of the JR train lines, including the bullet trains, at least a handful of them, not the like super express ones. Only the JR ones. Yeah, but uh, yeah, we got our tickets. We got to wait a little bit because the first train was so packed and they have any seats that are together yeah. still. So uh, we picked up some bento. Uh, Brittany's never had a bento before. Well, Oh, so yours looks like a pork tonkatsu. How cute is that? Look, it's all ready to go. Yeah. We got a little bit of sauce, tonkatsu sauce. Okay. Yeah, top six, all that. Very neat, nice. Uh, I've got a uh, double meat yakiniku. Beautiful. That's right. Over rice. Everything I want and nothing I don't. <laughs> it's very nice. We are gonna have a little a little meal here. It's nothing too fancy, but hey, you gotta have. A meal because it's gonna be like three hours yes. on that train. It's a long way out to Kyoto guys, but it's gonna be fun. Our Shinkansen has just arrived. I wanted to get some cool b-roll of it uh, zooming into the station, but it came so fast and so quietly I didn't realize what was going on. Like, it is super quiet when it rolls in. Yeah. It's not like a regular train. No, it's seriously... Yeah, like... yeah, it's nuts. Yeah. It's so cool, but uh, we're getting it all cleaned up. Uh, we do have reserve seats together, so they do like a three plus two kind of configuration yeah. there. Uh, should be nice. Well, we are seated. We got our nice reserve seats here on the Shinkansen. Yep. See the outside right there, we're all nicely locked in. Oh. Now we're nice and cozy. No, there's no one behind, so you can go ahead and recline. And they even have power outlets at the bottom down here. Little, little bags, little mesh nets, little tray table. stuff. Tray tables, so that way you can eat. All that stuff. That'd be nice. Couldn't it be a good trip? Yeah, right. It's the most relaxing in this entire trip. <laughs> we finally get to sit for more than like five, ten minutes. Yeah. It's super smooth, Brittany. So we're still taking off to the station, and it's just we're just coasting. It's so quiet. made it all the way out here to Kyoto and well what did you guess they just opened a new Pokemon Center thank you very much thank you very much oh thank you very much they already know that we're gonna buy a bunch yeah? of stuff look at that cute how cute yeah, so the Pokemon Center just opened yesterday yeah so it's pretty crazy uh it's super cute and super crowded in here. Yeah, Look cute. at this. My goodness gracious. And you get all the cute things, oh, Brittany. So cute. <laughs> what do you get? You get all oh, cute little bags. Yeah. How cute is that? Oh. Well, yeah, I mean, Pokemon to Kyoto. you don't really need more bags. No. Or more Pokemon stuff. No. But, uh, it's cute. You can't buy this stone. Oh, it's, oh. it's only available here. Oh. Exclusive. Uh, <laughs> oh no, Brittany. I'll think about it. I'll you think have to about think it. about it. It's very cute. Oh boy. A Pikachu one too. Thank, Thank you. You too. Oh, exclusive merchandise here at the Kyoto Center. Oh, Brittany. Oh man, it doesn't even. Maybe on the side. Oh, fifty. It's five thousand. Five thousand. Oh man, how about a small one? That's twenty bucks right there. Oh man. Like, well. That's this this alone is fifteen dollars. Remember, you go bigger. Doesn't cost as much to upsize. Oh boy, 
Still very cute though. Yeah. I like this little Pikachu one here. But I like the, the pink one as well. Yeah. The traditional style wallets. All of that. Cute. Yeah. What is that for me? Oh, it's the paper theater yeah, thing. Look at it. Oh, it's adorable. Brand new Pokemon Center merch. Exclusive. Once again. Exclusive to the Pokemon Center here in Kyoto. How about a keychain? Aww. How about a pair of keychains? Huh? Ah, I'm thinking about it. What are you gonna put in here? Um, like three what? coins. What is this? <coughs> oh, what is that? Oh, maybe it's like a makeup thing. Oh, maybe. Big plush right here. Look at this. Oh, he's adorable with his old Pokeball cup. He's ready for a little tea ceremony, don't you think, Brittany? Yeah, he is! <laughs> 2,400 yen for this guy and 1,500 for the keychain ones. Isn't too bad. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, this isn't too bad for like no. a specialized plush. Yeah. Exclusive. <laughs> Here's Lady Chew. Very cute. Yeah. Very prim and proper. Excellent. Look at that. Very nice. You got pins. You got little charms. Oh, phone cases, of course. Big phone cases. Also, one side's a boy Pikachu and one side's a girl Pikachu. Ah, you got like notepads, stickers, washcloths are cute, very cute. Oh, how do you choose, Brittany? Is that a cup down there? Yes. Oh, of course it is. Look at it. Huh. How to decide what to buy. Mmm. It has the three legendary dogs on here too. Oh yeah, very nice, very very nice. Oh, I I can't decide what to pick up. Oh, with is that an Eevee wallet? Yeah. Oh, very Eevee. Many wallets. It's so cute. Very cute. Look at that. Oh, just sleeping and dreaming and playing and enjoying. Thirty-five. Uh, not too bad. No. Cheaper than that other pouch. Yeah. The insanity. Oh my gosh, I can't even. <laughs> I'm trapped in the corner here, Brittany. Yep. Lots and lots of Pokemon. Oh my gosh. What is this, Brittany? It's Snivy. Oh. I didn't even realize because I'm busy dodging around all these people. Look at it. It's the wall of pokes. Lots and lots of pokes. Cable holders, things like that. Mm, cute, very cute. Very nice. Wasn't as satisfying as I thought it was going to be. I don't think so, no. Unfortunately. A lot of cute cases are dark. Yeah. You thinking about one, Brittany? Nah. No. Oh, okay. Brittany got something good. But the ditto one, though. Nah. But the ditto. Here we go, Brittany. This is what you need. This is all the stuff you need. You need that. You need that. <laughs> Can I have that? Can I have the little Pokeball set right there? Or the paper lanterns? That is cool. Pikachu fork. It's it's random. Yeah, and... <laughs> a spoon. A spoon? A spoon. I'll take a spoon. It's cute. All the little cookware here. I need... I need these zipper bags. Literally just little zipper bags. <laughs> Look at these cuties. Oh. Little keychains. Acrylic cut keychains. <laughs> I'll take this one, thanks. Right? I'll probably take the other one, too, thanks. This one, thanks. Take that, too. Thanks. <laughs> Brittany, look at these. Are these little mystery boxes? Yeah. Of pokes? Yes, they are. Oh, look, you can get it. They're cute, and they're all, like, running around in Sakura. Oh, man. How much? Uh, five five bucks. <sighs> There's a lot of different ones that are possible. They're cute, though. They are pretty cute. Finished up at Pokemon Center Kyoto. Uh, it was a madhouse. It was crazy. Yeah, we even talked a little bit with uh, a local who was here uh, yesterday too. And uh, it was even crazier then, I'm sure, because that, that was a Saturday. And uh, she was actually surprised. She's like, it just opened yesterday. How did you guys find out? About this? <laughs> we came all the way from Tokyo and it, it worked out. It's yeah. the perfect timing. So we got some extra gifts because it is the grand opening weekend. We each got for free right at the door. We got this cute Pokemon Center card right here. Yeah, it's very cute. Care. Yeah, super shiny, super cute. Got some of your favorites right here. You got Celebi like right on the front. Yeah. Excellent. And that's completely free just, yeah, for, coming that just for coming in. You didn't even need to buy anything. No. But because 
we purchased something. We also got a very cute, exclusive Pokemon Center Kyoto card yeah. of Pikachu's. The card. Yeah, very shiny. The it's cool. oh man, it's so shiny right here. I'm like, oh man, come on, <laughs> cut cut down with that glare right there. <laughs> because we purchased over a certain amount, we also got this exclusive Sakura Pokemon Center Kyoto uh, yeah. little little ornament decoration right there. It yeah. is super cute. Look yeah, at it's got, it's little, got petals. little petals. In it. Yeah. It's fantastic, isn't it guys? Oh, it's adorable. Man, and it's it's very special. Yeah. Just for us right here. Uh it really worked out perfectly because we had literally just taken the Shinkansen yeah. out to Kyoto yes. and we had gotten the little flyer for the opening of this at a different Pokemon Center in Tokyo and we're like, well, we're gonna be there that weekend. Yeah, and it's all like, oh, there's a new, there's a new Pokemon Center opening in Kyoto. <laughs> we're like, hey, that's the time we're going. Why not, right? <laughs> Why not? So, well, we braved the madness and totally worth it. Very yeah. cool. If you happen to be in the Kyoto area, check it out. Yeah. That Nishiki Market here in Kyoto. Ooh, it's starting to sprinkle a little bit, but anyway, we okay. wanna get inside. It's like yeah. a little market, a little street full of shops. Let's go see what they've got inside. Right. I don't even know what's in here, but I kind of want it. It's like little snacks. Photo spot. Oh, <laughs> it's fun just watching it. Uh... Beans. Look at those beans go. They told us to take the photo here, so here we are. <laughs> Look at them go. Whee! Fun. Beans, beans, and more beans. You can even get spicy beans. No. Sweet and spicy beans. Or just sweet beans. Sweet beans. Okay. It's only 490 yen. That's not bad. Huh. You can choose your flavors. Get like three quarters sweet and a quarter spicy. No. Then you won't know. It's like spicy roulette. Lots and lots of traditional candies here. These are cool. Wow. Green tea uh, rice cake. Yeah. It's like green tea mochi. Oh. Very nice. Look at it. Look at all the things. Be very mindful of how large my backpack is. Look at these little funny dogs. Some <laughs> bowls and cups and plates and sauces. <laughs> no, it's a tiny bowl now, but look how small it is. Tiny finger right there. Are you gonna get a cat uh, glass? I want him. <laughs> like the one on the right, Brittany. It's so cute. Look at him. It's like, yeah, that's my favorite. <laughs> so good. I mean, the frog is cool too. There's look. another cat one over there. Oh, oh big kitty. He's got a shirt on his head. <laughs> He's so silly. <laughs> so silly. Look at all these uh, craft beer glasses. They're small. That's they a do... small beer glass. Like, if they served small beers at bars, they would serve it in that. Yes. They are cute though. Oh, of course, takoyaki. Oh, yeah. There's so many things here, Brittany. I don't know what most of it is, if I'm honest, but it's pretty cool. Fish and fish and fish. Yeah, this goes a long while, Brittany. Oh man, we got skewers of stuff. That, that's my skewer right there. Oh, no. <laughs> it's just a massive fish. Brittany, what are these and why are they so cute? Look at them. Oh, they're little kitty crackers. Tiny like cookies? They look like cookies. Oh, oh. those are cute cookies, guys. Oh, it totally is. Oh, I think it's three, so you get one of each. Oh. But this one, you will get six. But this one, you can get the Tiss Box. Very popular. Look at that. I know. You want to get one? I'm thinking about it. Yeah. There's like the big box over there. Yeah. You get ten. You get I don't ten know if you need ten. I don't, we don't need ten. I'm kind of tempted to get a Papa box, too. <laughs> it's so cute, too. The cutest little candies. Oh. This squishy, squishy. Yeah, little gummies, right? It's about a dollar. Oh, you can get a whole set. Perfect. Those are cute. I would eat all of those. So many cute little treats and sweets here. Traditional candies. Oh. They're so cute. Look at these. I love the packaging on this. I love this, this little thing. jar. I love that it's like sideways. <laughs> I'm tempted, honestly. Yeah. Maybe, it's only five bucks. Maybe it tastes good. It's actually cheaper than oh, like cookies. I told you, cream, this one's cream soda. Oh. This is strawberry cream soda. Lemon. I love these kind of treats. Okay. Sounds good. Because it's got some more oranges in there. It's probably orange. <laughs> Fantastic. The little sushi candies. How cute. We have a couple different kind of styles there. There's a little bento one, too. Oh, so many. There's so many candies in this one shop. 
and there's oh. so many places. Yeah, and they tell you what the flavors are. Oh, okay, that's good. So red cherry, orange is orange. Yellow is pineapple. Light yellow is lemon. So be careful, Brittany. I know you don't like pineapple. So. Yeah, I don't like pineapple. So go, go for the light yellow. First, you got sakura flavored things. Oh, these are beautiful. Oh, they actually have a flower in them. Oh, that's fancy. It's just little like jellies. Yeah, I think they're just jellies. Mm. How gorgeous that is. Yeah. I like that very that's much. That's really pretty. There's this purple one, too. Mm, the purple one's nice as well. I like the little bits in there. Mm -hmm. Here's <laughs> these ones. Look at these, Brittany. <laughs> you come in a little set right there. A little like sakura shaped crackers. Yeah. They, they even decorated it so you've got little yeah. flower petals to go with it. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's really nice actually. You actually have the crackers underneath and then some jellies on top. Oh, maybe we should get this one, huh? Yeah. We found the Papa Treats. Look Papa Treats! Look how cute they are. Oh, Papa. Oh, Brittany, we're gonna walk out with so many things. Easy purchase. Yep. Kalani needs it. Yeah, Kalani needs it. She actually does. It's cherry blossom liqueur. It's so cute, Brittany. Oh, I'm tempted. It's only 843. Eight bucks? Yeah. Mm. Comes in the cute the box and everything. Look at that. Hard to resist. Adults out there, would you drink cherry blossom liqueur? <laughs> Octopus and squid. Oh man. A lot of things here, guys. This, it feels like the street goes on forever. I'm just curious. There's a lot of cool stuff, honestly. Oh, that's my section back there. It's all Why shrimp. It like oh, yeah. Got chestnuts here, Brittany. Got some juice. Some more dongo. Look at that. Just, just normal dongo. Yeah. All beef all the time. They serve only beef here. This is my favorite place. <laughs> Even the croquettes have beef in them. Yes. Look at that, Brittany. Want some skewers? Skewers. Mmm. The beefsteak one. Oh. Maybe the smaller one. Yeah. <laughs> Finally got our grilled beef meat skewers right here at Meat Shop Hito here in Nishiki Market. It's very nice. Tiny little skewers. Yeah, they're so cute. I bet they taste fantastic. I saw them doing some work on them. Yeah. Brittany, are you brave enough to try it? It's hot though. It does look pretty I warm. I can see it's steaming, but it's steaming. It's definitely steaming. Go for it. Mm. That's some beef right there. Mm -hmm. Tasty. There's lots and lots of veggies here out in the market too. Plenty of stuff. Finally getting near the end, Brittany. Finally. Oh, it took a like while. I feel like it was going on forever and ever. I know, right? I think we hit the end. Look how cute that is, oh, though. that's cute. I just wanted some, like, cool, like, side B-roll kind of stuff. <laughs> hey, Brittany. High five. Spicy? Oh, 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 man. Yes, yes. Oh, oh, man. man. Very good. Thank you. Look at this, Brittany. Oh, oh man. Ooh. I stopped at the big shrimp shop. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Look at that. Yeah. Very good. Look how good that is. Oh, only 500 yen. Oh, yeah, only 500. Three giant shrimp. They even season it all nice. Yeah. Spicy bit on this. Take a bite. Mm. Is that good? <laughs> Very good. Thank you. Oh, so good. Oh this my! The best shrimp I've ever had. Honestly. Really? It's huge and it's so. Flavorful. I'm tempted. You want to have a little? Bit? I'll take a bite. Beautiful flower shop here too. So random. They got succulents, little flowers, bigger flowers, the orchids over there. It's a cute. Yeah. Very nice. Chocolate. Dongo? Oh my gosh. Yeah, we could do like one of each. They're gonna be very different in flavor. Yeah. Brittany has been asked several times to try dongo. Yes. Those little, little dumplings. Well, we found a lot of dongo places all over Nishiki Market, but one stand had something very special. That's right, chocolate covered <laughs> dongo <laughs> with sprinkles. You have it a shot. Maybe you put sprinkles on it. Maybe right. you'll like it. It's only really a little different. I think it's kind of like almost like marshmallow in a way. Mm. You good? A little different, right? Yeah. Little squish, but they made it just fresh, just for you. Bam! Dipped. Nice, that hot chocolate. Like chocolate. Yeah. I mean, 
The dongo is basically a vessel for everything else. It usually is dipped in a sweet soy sauce. Yeah. You can see it right here. Too. Yeah, which I'm gonna have in a bit. Yeah. But I'll let I'll let you finish yours off, Brittany. Okay. Would you like a giant tempura shrimp, Brittany? Oh my god. Wow. That is so gigantic. Wow. That's huge. A little octopus with the uh, egg inside. So a little quail egg, a little squid too. It's adorable. I wish I wasn't so full. I would probably try the little octopus just because. We just got off at the station and there's this fun art deck like installation right here. You can actually interact with it. Yeah. You get a kittens. You get some tea. Get some cake. Did you just pour tea on my cake? Yes. Alright. That's fine. <laughs> Pick up this pillow. It's fun. <laughs> Very interactive. It's cute. It's, it's cute. It's kind of random, huh? <laughs> oh, you take the whole. Th don't do I that. Don't know if you're to. Okay, don't don't actually. But it's like 3D. Very 3D. Fancy. <laughs> We're out in Higashiyama for uh, Hanatoro. It's the last yeah. day of it. It's like an evening festival where they light up the area. Lots and lots of lanterns. There's like hundreds, maybe thousands. There's a lot of lanterns all up and down the area. They even illuminate the temples and things like that. So that would be kind of fun to check it out. Yeah. Experience some of the local culture, things like that. There's a lot of pretty things to see. So yeah, let's keep walking. Let's go. So around this park they have displays called Ikebana. It's a flower arranging. It's very traditional, very pretty. And they light these all up at night for Hanatoro. Well, I don't think the camera does this all justice, but we'll try our best here. It is quite lovely to see, guys. The arrangement of, it looks like a combination of like twisted driftwood, some other flowers, and uh, very pretty. There's a lot of these displays all over the place. Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> now this, this is a shop for me. I believe we're at Shosei Temple. Kyoto looks nice right here. Beautiful at night, all lit up with the lanterns and everything. Lots of people. We just missed the performance. Yes. Um. Yeah. Can't really do much about that. That's alright. Okay. It looked very lovely. Yes. And traditional. <laughs> and that's about all I can say because I know nothing about it. But. Uh, people dressed up and uh, lots of people just enjoying the evening very peaceful and very relaxing mm -hmm. the complete opposite of tokyo yes basically. it's pretty relaxing here yeah everything's very calm but it is cold definitely experiencing a drop in the weather <laughs> the, for Brittany, the face mask is not a uh yeah, it's, it's, not it's a face warmer, warmer. Yeah, i mean warm. my nose is a little runny but i think that's just because it's cold it's all good don't worry about it
following for Hilton Hop. No. I have no idea. But, uh, but it's, yeah. it's interesting. <laughs> yep. Being silent. Being carried. Yeah. She has a warm blanket on. I want to take it. <laughs> We're gonna keep following and see what happens. All right. We're following the fox mask lady to the end. It seems to be leading us over to Kodaiji Temple. Yep. The largest temple in the area, as far as I can tell. Uh, a lot of people are here. I do mean a lot. This is probably a big deal, guys. Oh yeah. We all made the pilgrimage out to here. Well, we've got our admission here for Kodaiji Temple. It's all opened up now because they've got the fox lady inside. Yeah. Uh, let's go. Let's, let's go. go check it out. You want to see some temples, right? Yep. <laughs> it's way more interesting right now than, uh, than uh, it normally would be. Oh, look at that shot there, Brittany. I'll do it. Oh, my God. Take it. Oh, it's gorgeous out here at night. Oh, absolutely beautiful. I gotta say, Brittany, it's kind of spooky. <laughs> but also kind of calming in this, you know, a way, you if know? If it was like October, I'd be too super like spooked out. <laughs> no, no, it's fine. So because of Hanatoro, they're open late. Walk the uh, the gardens of the temple at night. Very rare to be able to do this. Yeah. To me, oh, oh. oh. Take off your shoes. Oh, oh. thank you very much. We have to take our shoes off. Yep. Go ahead. Yep, see? Must be respectful. We are okay to take video and photos as long as we don't use a tripod. We will approach with everyone else to the main hall. Wow. got out of the main hall uh, we couldn't take photographs in there but nope. it, was, it was absolutely beautiful Some yeah nice sakura paintings and all that a little bit of history about the temple and now we're just in the main gardens so yeah. yeah there's a there's a lot it's beautifully lit up at and this night is all here. just the temple yeah all just part of it there's a 600 yen to get in mm -hmm. <coughs> honestly uh, totally worth it to help support the temple yeah especially on a special occasion like this let's keep walking all right It's so cool. You must touch the roadside Buddha statues in Higashiyama. Touch these beloved statues and altar objects to earn merit. The statues of Hideyoshi and Nene. Right? Apparently she, she built she built this place. So she her husband, so that's what he said. That's what the paper said. Mm. 
wishing for a happy marriage, just like Hideyoshi and Nene, who slipped through the warring states period. Aww. Wishing for peaceful remaining years, surrounded by many people like Nene. So, I'm gonna do both. So you're gonna do both hands. Right hand? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. There you go. Thank you, guys. Your turn. There you go. So that's it for our trip out here to Kodaiji Temple in Kyoto. It's our first evening out here. Long, uh, not that long. Actually, went pretty fast on the bullet train. Yeah. Uh, we enjoyed the uh, Hanakoro, the little evening uh, celebration. We did all the lanterns. Uh, an interesting procession with the fox mask lady. Yeah. And of course, the temple itself is very beautiful and with the changing interiors too, but you know, no photography to allowed. You'll have to experience it for yourself in person. But thanks for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed our little vlog out here. It's a little different. If you'll learn a little something about here, and maybe we'll get you to try pushing yourself out of your comfort zone. Check out some new things around yeah. the world, right? Including in, here in Japan. Thanks for watching. We hope you couple Don't forget to like and comment. Let us know what you think about our latest video from out here in Kyoto, Japan. And if you haven't, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. We've got lots of other great Japan videos coming for you guys. And while you're at it, make sure that bell is turned on. That way, you get notifications whenever we post new videos, all right? Mm -hmm. We've a lot of stuff in this trip. Finally, once again, a huge thanks to everyone who helped make Japan Trip Part 3 a reality. Absolutely amazing. There's still lots more to come, so stay tuned. Okay? Thanks, guys. Anyway, see you next time. Bye.